I'm Diana Prince, and this is Trending. The latest WikiLeaks hack emails reveal the, Clint the Clinton Foundation connection with Mr. Hashim Tachi. He is, he is Prime Minister of Kosovo. Mr. Tachi was managing a crime gang called the Drenica Group. This group was involved in organized crime through the 1990s. Some of their more interesting activities were money laundering, drug and cigarette smuggling, prostitution, and of course, human organ trafficking. Mr. Tachi, the now Kosovo president, closely cooperated with organization Climbs, Crime Structures in Albania, Macedonia, Bulgaria, and the Czech Republic. Drenica Group built an impressive large amount of power that flourishes in Kosovo. Clint Williamson, an American diplomat who went to investigate crime against humanity in Kosovo, stated that Drenica Group is responsible for murdering a group of people and trafficking their kidneys, livers, and other body parts. The group also murdered, kidnapped, and detained people illegally back in 1999. Despite the knowledge of the allegations against Mr. Tachi, the Clinton Foundation invited him to attend the Clinton Global Institute conclave in 2011, 2012, and 2013. The John Podesta hacked emails revealed that Tachi and his government have other connections to the Clintons. In 2012, the Republic of Kosovo signed a $50,000 lobbying contract per month with Podesta Group, a lobbying firm founded by John and Tony Podesta. John is Hillary Clinton's campaign chairman. The Podesta Group's re relationship with Kosovo and other foreign government is mentioned in WikiLeaks hacked Podesta emails. Hillary Clinton's campaign is really nasty, rigging the elections, creating chaos and in every Trump rally, and now the new revelations in involving her campaign with Mr. Tachi. We might not have ever known about the shady organ transplant smuggling that Clinton campaign has been an accessory to. If it wasn't for the courageous work done by the WikiLeaks people, I hope you will all pay attention to the facts that have been presented by the concerned people and not the emotional skulldoggery coming from the Clinton campaign when you cast your vote in November. Please follow us on Twitter and subscribe to our YouTube channel. I'll keep you informed with the latest trends. This is Diana Prince for The Goldwater.